Welcome. Congratulations on taking the first step to put, putting together your Route Scalper Pro Vendor Marketing Package. Uh, as you know, or most of you know, we have 30 brochures in the package. Uh, you've already received the prospect brochure. We give that out ahead of time because we know we have some students that are very aggressive and, and uh, are going to close some locations while the course is going on. We also know that our small and mid-sized vending companies that are taking the course, that they learn to scalp really quickly. And the first thing that they want to do is they want to sell those old dead wood locations they had when they started taking the course uh, because they're not making them any money. So that's the reason we give it to you. Uh, the way the uh, brochure package breaks down is hotel, milk, office, school, sugar-free, your company, software and telemetry, prospects, apartment, car dealer, water service, coffee service, frozen food, amusement, music, vending, expense. Uh, we've been using brochures ever since we started. Uh, in the beginning, um, dummy me, I didn't think that uh, we should have, you know, why would we want uh, brochures? Rick kept coming in the office and saying, you know, I'm used to having brochures and other things I've sold and, and done, and I know we need brochures for vending. So get off your butt and design some brochures. So I hired a graphic artist, and that's what we started doing. And as we uh, uh, went along, we'd have more and more brochures as uh, the years went on, and if something new come along, like uh, the combination machine, we'd design a new brochure for that. And if uh, something like the telemetry equipment come along, we'd re design a brochure for that. And then when the sense system come along, the misfin system, we knew we had to redo our whole brochure package, and we were doing that every four or five years anyway, or three years. So I just want to let you know, as, as I add new brochures to the package, uh, or we change them for any reason, you'll be given a whole new package or you'll be given the new, the new brochures and all that's free of charge. We're not going to charge you again. You have my word on that. All the brochures, both inside panels and outside panels, have uh, autofill boxes where you can put in your company name, your company website address, your contact name, your phone number, your email address. Uh, these boxes are on in on the front and the back of every brochure that we're going to sell you today. Um, also, it's got a check on some of the brochures for schools and hotels, as you know. Uh, the check can be, you can see right up here where it says ABC Vending. You can see I forgot to take out where it says address line. I should have backed that up and got rid of that. I forgot to do it. But you can put in the address, the city, the state. You can personalize the check instead of saying school. You could put the school's name in there. You can put the, uh, the date in there if you'd like. And instead of putting your company uh, name like ABC Bending there, what you can do is you can uh, uh, electronically sign it, or what Rick likes to do is take a pen and sign it. Uh, he does that a lot. And um, we like to highlight that we have the finest equipment, and we've got some tricky language in there because I know a lot of you guys are going to want to use uh, refurbished equipment. So it says, tired of aging, outdated looking machines that diminish your property's image. This is for a, a uh, uh, condo building brochure. We ensure that all your machines are top of the line. Here we go with a fresh out of the box look. So you can get away with using refurbished equipment and be honest about it. Uh, we like to show them all of our fancy machines because we know our competitors only have a 10% budget. And you guys, for example, are new to the vending business, so therefore you're going to have to buy new, or lease new machines for every location anyway. Uh, so you might as well show them off in your brochure. And the other thing is that uh, if you're in the vending lease management company, you haven't got a problem because uh, you're passing this cost on to your third-party vendor. We like to show them all the new gizmos on our machines and talk to them about that. Uh, it's really, really important uh, for you to also let them know that you have a full line of products because they're used to dealing with companies that just will not fill requests. You know, a school or an office will call the company and say, could you get us this? Could you get it? They always say, oh yeah, we'll try to do that. And then that's the end of it. They never talk about it again. Uh, we like to show them all of our products. And these are just metaphors for any product, uh, you know, that you can get in your area. Uh, don't worry about it if you can't get certain things. Uh, I'm sure, though, because all these are national products, that you can get these products. Uh, and you can see how pretty the pictures are. We get them straight from the manufacturers. And by the way, I, I want to tell you about this. Swans, which is the biggest frozen food uh, company in the world, 
they have told us that they are now delivering to vendors so that they'll deliver these products straight to your door. We'll tell you more about that in the course. Uh, we like in all, in all the brochures, what we do is we plant seeds so they wonder why their vending companies do certain things. And then we draw a coalition about how we do a better job. For example, here, our standards are a result of good business sense. Unlike most of our competitors, we know that retaining our clients year after year is just good business. We realize it costs more to move out equipment and search for new clients than it does to retain our clients by ret uh, treating them the way we would like to be tr treated. Transparent bookkeeping, impeccable service, uh, top of the line equipment, so again, you can see as we make a promise, we also plant a seed about our competitors. And we do it again over and over and over like this. Your office is always our first business. We retain our clients. And then we go on to say time for truth and vending. Hey, it's your space. It's your space. So why lease it to a vending tenant who gives slow service and fudges numbers or tries to pay less than he should? Uh, we will be the kind of tenant you always hope for, paying on time, making you profits, and improving the image of your office. Again, we're making promises here, too. Honest vending is the total solution. Uh, and we talked to them about our, our uh, competitors, serve, uh, how they service locations, better product service. Most vendors schedule their route driver service visit only once every 10 days. See, they get to think, hmm, I don't see that guy that often. Therefore, your employees and guests' favorite selections are constantly sold out. These guys always have sold out selections, and that's what we're, we're drawing their attention to. Make up, uh, uh, to. To make up for this faulty service plan, they will stock the same product in several different selections, which decreases your available choices. We visit you on an as-needed basis. Uh, we tell our clients, just to be frank with you, that we're going to come every day for the first five or six days, and then we'll get a, a feel for how they buy products, and then we'll readjust the service. So we also, in the brochures, we reveal the DEX system secret. We tell them that every machine in your location has a DEX system. The DEX system is a computerized accounting system featuring a non-resettable perpetual counter for tracking total gross sales. Uh, we, you know, we we just play uh, devil's advocate all the time with our competitors, and they hate us for it. But I love this one, and I think you guys will too. Some companies simply bid to win. How can they pay 25% and more when their expenses are? Then I list their expenses, and I show them it's 90 cents on every dollar. Then I ask the question: Keep in mind, your commission's not there. It's not listed there. Uh, how do they actually make a profit after paying you their, uh, your commission? It's the bidding industry's dirty little secret. They don't always bid what they are willing or able to pay. Uh, we, we love to show them every type of machine possible when we're going after different accounts. If you're, if you're going to be in the tavern route business, uh, these, uh, these pictures are just beautiful. If you're going to be in snack and beverage or you're going to be in all these different segments of vending, uh, these machines are just beautiful because we get the pictures straight from the manufacturers. And don't worry about uh, the huge product line because you are going to have to fill requests. Uh, and you're not going to have to keep all this stuff on uh, hand. Uh, quite the contrary. We tell them that all of our machines have DEX uh, uh, hard drives in them. We tell them that all the machines we're going to install is going to have a credit card reader. And, of course, we tell them the census system is going to be on every machine. Here's how it breaks down, guys. They hate to be lied to. That's number one. Number two, they hate to be cheated. Uh, that's number two. Number three, they hate old, broken-down machines. And number four, they hate refunded money. Listen to what I say here. Vending machines misfins anger customers. Sure, every machine can misfin. The most common reason is the most vending companies install older, outdated, unreliable machines. You get stuck with the dirty job of dealing with angry customers who demand their money back, but there is a better way. Uh, we've been uh, doing this for so long, I wouldn't know how to run a company without a brochure, and I don't know how these other guys don't, but in 30 years, I've never seen any other vending company have brochures. Now, having said that, I have to say to you that I'm, I have to say that without brochures to help you overturn high-volume locations, there are no guarantees how successful 
uh, you will be. The reason I bring that up is we've never tried to overturn a location without them. And uh, the only two correlations I can draw is that our third party vendors, which have no idea how we do our marketing, when they try to go out and get locations, they have a tough time of it very slow going. But the students that we train, since 95, 93% of them all buy our brochures, they rave about how fast that they overturn locations. So that's all I can really go on. I don't think without brochures that, that you'll be able, you know, you'll be able to do the volume that you should do. But this is totally up to you. If, you're, if you don't want to buy them, that's fine. If you want to create your own brochure, uh, email me and I'll, uh, I'll give you all the information I, I can do. Uh, that I can to help you do that. Uh, our brochures that we give out uh, are really bright, they're well designed. It took uh, myself and a, a, our graphic artist Allison, it took us over six months to redesign all these brochures. Uh, there's a, just, they're just beautiful, I think. I hope you feel the same way. We have all sorts of interesting gra uh, graphics in here like this uh, school vending machine pyramid. Uh, we uh, like to talk to them about our sugar-free pr uh, program. Uh, your brochure should help you plant the seeds and then harvest the bounty. Uh, as you know, uh, we use a variety of brochures to facilitate overturning high-volume uh, vending contracts. That's how, uh, the, you know, it's part of the whole strategy. There's nothing more powerful than when you put your brochure in the hands of, uh, of the person that is the decision maker of the companies, organizations, and schools that uh, you're targeting to scout. I mean, they're fantastic marketing uh, 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 tools that way. Route Scalper brochures help you plant the seed and push the buttons that you're trying to push to get uh, these companies to act. For all that a good brochure can contribute, though, I have to be honest, uh, to a marketing program, it's uh, rarely the keystone of a total marketing effort, nor should it be. But a brochure is an adjunct to a marketing plan, uh, and it's a very powerful tool when it's used that way. In conjunction with other marketing tools such as well-written and easy-to-understand contract, industry-specific letters, postcard mailers, and a well-thought-out location lead site, brochures are tangible with staying power. They give dimension and weight to anything you say about your vending lease company or your vending management company's capabilities. And in short, I guess the only thing I could say to sum it up, uh, a well-designed brochure speaks for you when you're not there to, uh, to speak for you, your company, or your services. It demonstrates your uh, vending company's most valuable asset, in my opinion, its uh, integrity and its intellectual capital. And like I said, in three decades, never seen another vending company use them. And that's a great deal because that gives all of our scalpers and us a big, big, big uh, head start on these companies. And one of the reasons is these guys give nothing to their prospective clients or to their clients in writing about their marketing program, about uh, their services. They don't talk about, for example, you know, it's they want to know, like, if a machine breaks down, how long is it going to take you to be here? Well, we tell them we're, in our brochures, we're going to give them 24-hour turnaround service. Uh, we describe all our services and all of these brochures. And keep in mind, your competitors give them nothing in writing. Uh, but we're getting a lot of emails from uh, our students that uh, want to buy the brochures and different products. And they said, you know, in these hard times and because of the recession, they're having a hard time sometimes uh, affording some of the tools. You know, they got to feed their families. Uh, you guys, I understand that. Uh, that you got to feed your families, you got to put your kids in school. So what Rick and I have decided to do is start discounting some things, and we're going to start right here. Uh, we're going to discount this package 33% for you. Instead of charging you $297, we're going to charge you $197. Uh, if you were to try to recreate this package uh, like this, uh, you would be in this five, six, seven, eight thousand dollars $8,000. I know because I created the package. So you saw the little button that just popped up a few seconds ago. If you click on that, you, know, you can go over to the other side. You can check out and you can download these brochures immediately. Once again, thanks for time, uh, taking the time to uh, listen to my little video. And uh, congratulations on taking the first step to putting together your Route Scalper Pro Vendor uh, Marketing Package.